Yes, so they are pretty much just giving a word of advice for everybody. They're saying, yes, you can go outside and have some fun by the waterways, but not without keeping your safety in mind. They say that the number one rule that they have for everybody wanting to go near the waters this week is to have a life jacket on at all times. San Joaquin County officials are expecting a very busy 4th of July weekend, particularly along the rivers. At Buckley Cove Park by the San Joaquin River, many folks are already setting up camp and hopping on their boats. Some waterways in areas including the San Joaquin River, the Delta and the McCollumie River have been under closures or restrictions in the last few months because of hazardous conditions, but those restrictions are set to be lifted by Wednesday afternoon. Officials say some parts along the McCollumie River will still see some restrictions. The ones that remain in place are really on the upper part of the McCollumie River. Um, we still see a lot of debris in the waterways. We still have a lot of cleanup at some of the parks and things like that to do. The county sheriff's office says advisories for the waterways are still in place. Our biggest thing is please practice like self-precaution for yourself, life jackets. If you're going to drink, drink responsibly. Keep your eyes on your children. Um, and even some of the strongest swimmers have a challenge out there. Officials say there's no reason not to go out for some fun as long as safety is kept in mind. But swimmers and outdoor goers won't be alone this week. Really, it's going to be our sheriff's department voting units that are going to be out. Um, our fire departments will also be monitoring. We're there to support. So we're there to remind you to um, drink responsibly. Don't drink in boat. Don't drink and drive. Uh, if we see you out on the water, our boating safety unit, they're going to be out. Officials say it's also important to pay attention to the signage that you may see around some areas just to see what's closed and what's not, but also what activities are allowed and which ones are not. Reporting in Stockton, Josie Hart, KCRA 3 News. Yeah, it's pretty out there. You got to just be careful. Thanks, Josie. Well, San Joaquin County Sheriff say that they have responded to multiple emergency calls and at least one drowning just in the past few weeks, and they say that this can be preventable by, again, having those life jackets on.